Hi Pisces, how are you? I hope you're doing well. Welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading. I will cover the overall energies here for you, specific details, what is the good thing coming towards you, and also the person that is currently on your mind. Keep in mind that this reading may or may not resonate with all of you. If it does, there's an extended at the end of this video. Now let's start. First, let's shuffle the deck four times for you. So let's begin. First, let's check the overall energy. Two of Pentacles, the Devil, the Star. I think somebody here wants to get back at you, but they are indecisive. They do have lots of attraction and it seems to me like there's this person from the past that has been very distant to you but they want to heal all this, and that ending with the Ten of Swords was quite painful. It was coming long time before, in fact. It was quite heavy in the past. Why is this indecision from this person of the past? This is the overall energy. Huh? The star. They are not sure if this will be healed, if this will be recovered and repaired. That's why they are very indecisive. Now, what is affecting you in your subconscious at this moment? You want progress, movement forward, no stagnancy. You want more luck in love and life in general. Maybe you are feeling a bit pessimistic that things have not been going your way or to your expectations. Now, what was the main challenge in the past? Page of Swords, problems with communication, it may have not been mature, there may have been lack of communication, lots of sadness here, five of cups, lots of disappointment that happened. You have been reflecting a lot, but you realize that it was not going any further. I think that there may have been this energy of trying to detach from the past completely, but it was going in circles. This person was coming back, trying again, you giving chances or trusting that this would be better. How do you view the situation? You want progress, but you don't expect them making a move. You see them very withdrawn, very resistant to open up. That's how you view the situation with them. Your focus is this Two of Cups. You want a soulmate connection, that kind of chemistry and energetic uh, connection. A great friendship, a great love, mutual understanding, understanding, understanding each other without talking, um, understanding each other without talking, that kind of chemistry, that's what you are looking forward to. You want more harmony in your love life. <clears throat> Let's see more details, Queen of Pentacles, and you are hoping that your next relationship will be stable, strong, and with a mature partner. Now let's see about the current energies. Two cards, Queen of Cups, the world. I think that you have a good energy at this moment. You have lots of love to give. And just be aware to give this love to the right partner. That love is so big and powerful that it can lead to something long-term and stable like marriage, a successful connection. I think that you are surrounded by, after this Empress reversed with a person of the past, this disconnection that happened there, I think that you are surrounded by love, stability, lots of attraction from others towards you. And this is a very good energy, in fact. Success and much more emotional stability. I see you more mature in love as well. 
you have learned a lot from this experience and you don't want to negotiate anything but just a loving and successful long-term commitment. What is the good thing coming towards you in the near future? Nine of Cups reversed. I think that you will come to realize that the true happiness that jewel is inside yourself. That's the only way to find happiness and stability in life in general. And not expecting it to come from others, but sharing it instead with others. Sharing it will make you even more happier as well. Now let's see about this person that is currently on your mind. If you are liking this video, you can hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed already, you can subscribe because I post videos every day and you can click the notification bell icon to get notified for the new videos as well. Now let's continue again with the person that is on your mind. Let's see about their energies. They do think a lot about you. And they want to find a middle way on how to reconcile all this and make peace. And they're moving slowly, in fact. They're not quite sure there will or there would be a much faster uh, stability between you both. They want to express something. They want to talk. They want to offer a proposal to you. Yes, they want to offer you much more stability. And they are thinking if they should uh, approach you with affections and um, being romantic or in a very formal or friendly way. They want to heal all this. They know that there's lots of pain that happened in the past. They want you both to be happy, much more happier. Now, the attraction is very, very strong and um, still they do think a lot about you. They think about that relationship that you had with each other, but the problems, the conflicts that were present may be stopping them from reaching immediately and is making them a bit unsure if it is easy to make peace with you and uh, make things right. What they're looking for a word to is a loving relationship, stability, and there's a chance you may hear from them in an unexpected way, when you think they forgot you. That's a moment when they may reach out and you will notice exactly that this person has changed and wants something serious, really. They are with a ten of pentacles. Let's see an advice for you for this person. What is an advice for you? Four of Cups, Ace of Wands, Seven of Pentacles. It is telling you not to rush an important decision with them if they come with a proposal immediately. But take your time and see if it is just lust or love. If it is just attraction, or there are feelings involved there. Do not rush this. That is the advice for you. But if this reading resonated with you, I will continue this in the extended with more details about them, about you, about their feelings. I want to view about this good energy as well. This nine of cups reversed. This is the good thing that is coming towards you. Let's see about that. Possibly a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Maybe another Pisces. But let's see the extended, and uh, it is in the description box below this video. Thank you for watching. See you in the next reading, and bye for now.